with more Tomb Raider 3 action. We're going to be taking you through the second level, which is Temple Ruins, Tomb Raider 3. Um, again, we'll take you through the whole level as per all of our other videos, and we'll be taking you through where to go, and um, yeah, where all the secrets are as well, so we'll be covering off all the secrets. In this particular level, there is four. So I'm attempting to find all of them, which I'm pretty sure I can do that. So yes, I hope you you'll enjoy all this what I'm doing. But yes, right. So if we do a left here, we've got a small midi pack to collect. If we go along here, there's going to be a snake here on the left. So just be careful of that. Take that snake out. On the ground, nope. We've got some monkeys that we just need to take out here. And then they can drop them down. And put up here. So there's some um, uh, anim ammo, sorry, over, over this sort of way. Up here, got some ammo here, and then some shotgun shells above that. So here we go here, and it's going to drop down here, and then we need to go over to the left here, or to the right rather, um, and then into here. The next thing we need to do is we need to do a running jump over here. There's no primers around, so a running jump over here, and then we get ourselves up here, and up we go. Just to make sure the primers are all over to the other side for you to do that without losing any health. Once we've done that, we just need to do a dive into here. Down here. And then we should be able to follow this round and up. And then up we go. The monkeys to take out. No one's here. And there'll be another one there, and then we need to jump up here, jump up again, there's some oozy clips just over here, and then we just need to follow this over to the left here, and then keep going. There's a, a monkey here. Take out another one. And what we want to do is there's some ammo over here, so we just want to do a running jump over. Some oozy clips there. And then we need to jump down and basically just do what we've just done again. Again. And back around here. Here we go. There will be another monkey. Got a save down crystal here to collect. And then jump over. Okay, so now we need to do a running jump onto this block here. Put ourselves up. And then another running jump over. Into the waterfall. So we go up here, in here we go, drop down and then slide down backwards. We can grab the ledge like that. And we just need to shimmy across here. Just keep going. And then there is some shotgun shells here. A 
ourselves back down and then move towards the right again. Oh, hey, we've got to go up. And pull down. And then we still have jump into the waterfall. There is some flares and be careful with the snake as well. But all there is here is just some flares, that's all it is. Yeah, so I'll clip those. Back out through here. And then do another jump over. We jump up here. Jump over. Another cheeky one, please take out. And then we just crawl under here. And down the slope we go. I think there's any. There is a snake. There is a snake. A snake there to be careful of. So down we go. Be careful over here, but there is no snake. Just about misses if you get it in time. Okay, and then you go down here, be careful of the boulders. Just gonna do that. Uh, okay, so we come into this part here, there are some shotgun shells here. And then there is a block here in the corner, we just need to pull this out. Onto the block, jump down, and then there is some shotgun shells here. Let me to crawl under here. Up. Oh, there is this statue still comes alive. Basically, you can't shoot it while it's got swords. Cover it up to its face. I'm going to speed things up a little bit by using the shotgun I think, on this bit. Up here, we've got the snake gang crystal and two switches that we need to pull. We're going to go for the one on the left here, which is the one we're going to do first, and jump up. Down there were two monkeys to get off here as well. And then we just need to get into the next room here. Be careful of the fire. I'm just gonna jump down here and then there is a lever here. If we stand in the middle, we should be fine, we shouldn't get caught. This opens this up down here, so we've got to be careful of this poisonous thing here, and then also be careful of the fallen sort of fallen walls, do we call them? They will obviously kill you. We're going to the corner here.
the medi pack over there, so I'm just gonna go and get that. Side here and then do a running jump over to that ledge. Like that. Stand and jump here. Might as well reverse it I think we've got to jump up here again. Jump here and then move up. Going up. The snake over there. We're just going to for now. Let's go onto that ledge over here. So we should be able to just do a standing jump over there. And we've got to be very careful with this part here. We've got to jump into there. Work that so we don't get hit. Take out the snake. We jump into here. And then jump into here. Be careful of that boulder. You just gotta move down. Grab the ledge there like that. There's a bit of a puzzle here. The thing to do with this, so you know you'll be alright, is to go underneath and to go underneath this as well. Best thing to do. And you'll notice there's a small medipack here, and we have a secret here. We're approaching the secret is down. Secret was down here. Oh, I may stand this part over here. Put the secrets over here. Yes. So we're just going to let go here. And then just walk into this. These spikes. Fall down. Go through here. And there's a secret. There's a snake in here as well, we gotta be careful of. Save them crystal, which will obviously always come in handy. Some ammo here to collect. Go backwards. Some moody clips there as well. And this will probably come be a bit familiar. This part here, this this bit. Okay, so back through here we go. Yeah, and then crawl under. Just crawl all the way over to here. And we should be able to jump up here. Now we can't. Okay. We can't jump up anywhere here, can we? Okay, I think we're gonna have to go out that window then, aren't we? Never mind, let's go back in here. Oh, 
go all the way through here. Up down here. And up we go. And I think we need to go to that ledge over there. I can't promise anything wrong with that one over there. I don't think we're going to make that ledge over there. We'll try it. No, I think that was a bit optimistic, that one. Doesn't matter. We'll just climb up the header again. She's not going to take too long. Right, so here we go. So here, go back flip here. Oh, it's over here, isn't it? We'll still have and jump over to there. Jump up here. Jump up to the ladder. Then go up. Go stand and jump across here. Running jump over to this ledge here. Standing jump here. And then a standing jump over to here as well. Again, we might as well just crawl under all this. Then we don't get hit. And then we just need to do a running jump over here. Get the sleeping on crystal. Here you'll notice a block. Need to push that out. And then I think there's a block to the right here. Push that out. And then I think we do it again. And push it again. Again, yes we can. Okay, and this is where we get into the next part. I may, may save it here. Okay, we're going to pull out these blocks, push them out. I'll push this one here. Again, can we? No. Push this one. We should be able to pull this one out. Pull this one out and then push down one and we should get to a lever. Yeah. 
Then we just flat out move this down. So you don't get hit by the boulders, just keep running. Come down to here. Make sure you're going down the, the left one there. Not the right one because there's spikes. I'm going through here. And swimming all the way up to here. Up the ledge. Into a small little pool here. Put in the lever here to the right. And that should reveal where the first key is. Which is there. Uh, we come up here now. And then through back through here. Down here. And then all the way into this little hole here. We pull the lever. There is a third, uh, second secret is instant here. We pull, push this um, block out here. Do a lift. This is where the next secret is. Down here. Go backwards and then jump up to avoid the boulder. Layers here and then move back. Okay, so pa past here, got a small mini pack here, pick up, and then there is some shotgun shells here as well. So back in here, do a running jump through this quicksand here. So she should survive this if you just keep going and don't stop. Just keep going. Keep going. I'm going to use a small midi pack here. And my jump here. Okay, so next thing is to kill off this monkey. It's probably why I have to maybe save it now. I'm not going to, I'm going to take the risk, but this bit can be quite tricky. I'm just going to, yeah, okay, I think I might run through some of this jump you can do it without not losing any health but I'm not quite skilled yet once we approach the next part let's take out one monkey and then there's another one push the block out Out again. And then to the right, pull it out. If you jump up onto the block. You don't need to jump up here, and this is where the third secret is. To the third one. Jump all the way over here, and then we need to jump up here. And this part here is actually a ladder, so we can jump up here. And that we go to the top. And 
And there you are. That's the third secret. There's an ammo here to get. And most importantly, there's a switch as well. To pull. Be not that way. Need to go through to the other room. Need to go down here, don't we? With our cells down the ladder. And then just get right to the edge. And then drop off. You only lose a little bit of health there. Okay, so now. Come back round with a lever over here. And we just need to pull down. And then this block here, we just need to pull out this way. And pull out again. do a jump up there and then let's go down in here so now we need to pull the switch here that's the first switch there okay go back down again So there's a switch to the right and a switch to the left. Let's pull this one. Swim and do the next one. And that should release a little hatch that we've just passed. And then up here. And then we put ourselves up. So, it's probably wise to use another save game crystal, I think that's probably what I'm going to do, just to be on the safe side. Um, you don't have to, but uh, for me, I'm just going to just gonna do that, and I'm hoping it's going to be my last one, so I'm hoping. Um, yeah. Let's save it now. We have the full secret now. that lever and we need to go into this here. Get into the little alcove, the door will shut. We should be able to pick up. Ready pack. All the items basically. There you go, that's the full secret. So as you can see, there is four out of four there, secrets found. Let's, let's jump up here now. The next thing we need to do is we need to somehow get up to there. Yeah, 
and there's some more levers that we need to press at the moment. So we need to go for this one here. And this one here. And this one. You can see there those invisible blocks. That is what we need to jump onto to get to that block, which I guess will have something up there. Okay, so let's jump up here. Make sure there's nothing around. Clever. Let's do that again. And wait for the next one. Okay, maybe there isn't one. Maybe we just do a straight jump over. No, there's one. Must be on the other side. And pull that switch down. I think that may make this dude come alive. Didn't? Well, it must do. Oh, it's a time switch. Damn it. happening that the spikes are going to come after us. There we are. Finico. That can be quite challenging that part. Why has this man not come alive yet? Now we've got a bunch of quicksand to get through now. Wait. Now is it left or do we go towards the right? That's the question, isn't it? Didn't want to use any more save game crystals here. Oh, I did that, wasn't it?
Maybe we'll go to the right. I think I'm going to try going into the middle. Go to the right and then jump into the middle. Take a chance. I just need to keep going. That's worked. Okay. So let's jump up through here. Saying good, is it? Probably there as well. Look at that. You know, something touchy. I like the sound of this somehow. Don't like the sound of it. Steps would trigger it off. into here. slowly make our way down here. And then we should be able to use both keys. Jump up the ladder quickly. Uh. 
Look at this block here. And then jump up. And then we're going here. Run and jump over. Do the same with this. I mean, that was close. Nearly had it then. Nearly had it. Wow. That was good movement. Make sure we've got anything. Yeah, it looks good. Go down here. A flame to go. Put another one of these dudes to kill off. He drops a sword as well. Over here, some shotgun shells. Need to go into this little block here, jump up to the left. That's that's the next one. I use a medi pack here.
can hear you though. I should get rid of him. He dropped another sword. in there. Tools need to be used in this dude. No. No. Okay, yeah, well. This one. That should open the door. Yes, it does. I'm not sure if we're going to come alive. Some ammo to collect. I think she did. Left. Oh, right. I don't think it matters. I think this is the end. We we're getting near the end. One last bit to do, I believe. down here and then drop down to use a shotgun and speed from the technical bit. Use one. Flares here. I 
Okay, so I think we can start to go into the next part. So we'll look around here. Crystal here. There's three keys. Great, I've got one. Okay, there's two more to get. One is in here, and I believe this is quite a difficult bit to do. Let's go something over here. This looks a bit challenging to me. Looks a bit mm, spikes, yeah. Thanks. This just looks a bit okay. Gotta use a medi pack here. I'm gonna use another flare as well. Down here. Yep, yeah, like that. Great. Okay, so we've got the key here. And then we've got the last part here. Don't want to use a save gun crystal. This could cost me. I've got 13 of them. Really don't want to use them. But I believe the current's going to get me. I need to swim to the left, I think. should be able to take one lever. Should have enough strength to get to the right and then pull the next lever. And hopefully should stop the actual current itself and allows me to get the key. Which it does. Up we go. And now we just slot the keys into the key holes. One, two,
free. That should open the little hatch at the top. So we should better jump up into this and that should be the level complete. And that is how you do it. That is all four secrets. A complete guide and walkthrough of how you do the level. There are some difficult bits in that, yes, and some difficult puzzles. So, yeah, use your saving crystals wisely, I, so I would say. I think I used two in that one, so it was pretty good going, considering the amount of puzzles and things there are. We hope you enjoyed this, please like and please subscribe.